There you go. Um, yes, the Twitch Pixel Donator Badges. If you want to try to make the dona uh, the donation badges and you have like a sample or two you want to send me, it's um, on the vinesauce.com contact. Look for my info. And uh, there you go. Anyway, that's a whole different story. Right now, we're back in Minish Cap. And... Last time... I made it about halfway through this dungeon. And Ezlo is ever being helpful by telling me not to fall from the Sky Palace to my death. Oh, you know how Ezlo he is. Not the donation badges, subscriber badges. I think I said it wrong, sorry if I did. Um, whoa. The subscriber badges, like the loyalty badges. I missed a heart piece, I'm gonna try to go get that. So much Link screaming. So, uh, people... Well, here's... Alright, fine. I, I should probably explain so people aren't left scratching their heads. Um, hours are a little dark to see, and I know a bunch of people, including Desert and Mono, have been trying to rework them. However, I was thinking of something a little more stylized, a little something like this. Now, you only have 18 by 18 pixels to work with, but I was wondering if maybe there's a way to make the vine stuff look like metals or like things of different materials, like a stone badge, a bronze badge, an emerald badge, a gold badge, platinum, and have different like kind of textures on them and not just colors. And they would be a shroom or maybe slight variations on the shroom. Now, this was the example that Twitch had, and I thought this was a cool example. Um, even though 18 by 18 is super small to work with, I think it still can be done and um ours are okay they look pretty damn good but they're also they're they're hard to see because they're real small and the colors are a little hard to see when when it's so small so i figured there's probably a better way to do that um the idea being i will actually hire someone spend a few bucks uh if anyone wants to do some samples if they do pixel work i'll choose someone that did a particularly good job and then I'll give you a few bucks and we'll, you know, we'll get some new badges up in this bitch. Okay, so I don't really remember where the heart piece is, but I'm just gonna retrace my steps. And hope for the best. Yeah, a few bucks to buy three for you. Actually, I'm talking more like 30 bucks. If you do a real good job. But if you're looking for like three for you, I could give you $3.50 as well. I mean, whatever you'd prefer. sure where the fuck this thing is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll look at the sample, then commission them. Like, if you send me one, if, if it's uh, along the lines of what I'm thinking, then I'll... So don't, don't make all of them. You know what I mean? Don't go out of your way and make all of them. Like, send me one or two, and then we'll take it from there. I'll let you know through email whether or not it's, uh... It's worth it. And if this sounds like a bunch of horseshit to you, then don't worry about it. Just enjoy the stream and pretend nothing happened. I know, $30. Think about it. You could buy a whole Steam sale. 17 games. Maybe more. Or you could buy half of No Man's Sky. I'm sorry, I don't mean to invoke the name of, of the No Man's Sky. I, I know how that inflames and infuriates so many people. I think I'm going the right way. Uh, I 
hate having to retrace, but it has to be done if we're going to get that heart piece. Spirit Rhodes in chat just found a shiny Meowth. I repeat, Spirit Rhodes in chat just found a shiny Meowth. It's good info. Um, speaking of emails, have you checked yours recently? I sent you a thing like two weeks ago. Uh, this is the part where I come across like a cunt, so bear with me. I may have passed over your email. It may have been totally buried in my other emails. It may have been something that I couldn't respond to or did not want to respond to. Because I do get like 300 emails a week, dude. It's, it's, I'm not kidding. It's, it's insane. And I have checked recently. My responses have been shit lately because I haven't really even had much of a chance to do so. So, if you send me an email and it's a picture of Grandad, chances are you're not getting a response. Sorry, mate. Sick and tired of hearing a bunch of damn emails. Sorry, someone in chat just reminded me that that existed. If it's a, you know, if it's a good email and it's and it's something that you really want me to respond to, just go ahead and send it again, and I'll just, uh, I'll do my best. Really, I do my best. Oh, fucking Christ. And then someone else in chat just said, um, Grandad is just a Lolan Mario. I swear to fucking god. No, wait, no! Shit. <clears throat> Mono says, Vine Sauce, what if your actual grandfather was trying to contact you? <laughs> From the grave? <laughs> it's like a spirit communication, and I'm just thinking it's bad memes. It would be proof of the afterlife, like I would, I would be a millionaire. Oh, by the way, speaking of Monos here, uh, we're doing uh, the pizza co-op map, too, this weekend, if anyone uh, remembers that. Fuck. Oh, I'm such an asshole. I didn't hold the button long enough. Yeah, good jump! Does your dad own an M1 Garand? If so, he may be a Garand dad. Get this checked out at your local doctor immediately. Will Barrels of Fun be in it? Um, I don't know. I would like for him to be a part of this. Uh, he's... He is Barrels of Fun. Uh, does anyone know where he is? Barrels, are you in the house? Barrels will be. He, he will be with us. I'll make. I'll make it so. Even if Barrels doesn't want to be with us, he will be with us in spirit. Um, I don't think I passed the heart piece. But... 
I'm wondering how long it's gonna take for me to fucking get to it. Because this seems excessive. I I've gone through the entire entire dungeon thus far. It's still nothing. Well, almost the entire dungeon. Is Vinny really Italian? He is. Very Americanized Italian. I don't know how cool of a gimmick it would be for me to claim I was Italian and then not be. You get the second... You get the heart piece in the second part of the dungeon. Really. I'm backtracking. Fruitlessly. Alright, whatever. Yeah, the heritage thing is not a, an issue. I, I... I never really, um... I never really made it a thing. Other people kind of like play up the Italian thing. It's just I'm kind of just a dude. I'm like a white guy, you know, that just makes bad jokes and plays video games and glitches them sometimes. I am a many generation down Italian. I'm very pale. I'm very pale. How much further do we have to go? This place goes on forever. There's no point in complaining about it. We must press onward. After all, how much could there be? Come on, Link, let's go. Well, there was the whole first half of the dungeon that I just redid. <laughs> so for anyone who hasn't watched the, this previous stream of Zelda, now you have an entire recap of what the dungeon looked like. So that was for your benefit, I swear. We were just having some fun. Just to- just to catch up. Do I have some kind of unspoken bond with other Italians? Well, we were part of the Axis at one point. That was a regrettable decision. Um... I don't know. Growing up, I kind of became a little disillusioned with the boppity boopity culture. So I'm not really crazy about it. I don't know about no unspoken bonds. Necessarily. Okay, um, alright, here's what we're gonna have to do. Bippity-boppity culture, yeah, that's a different thing. That's- that's fine. Okay, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Alright, okay, here's what we gotta do here. Oh, that's the wrong item. Boomerang works well on these fuckers. So, I have to clear these first. Do they get their wings back? No, they don't. They do. Takes a while, though. Um, I fucked up again. I need, uh, I need the three. This is three. I need the three, and I do not have the three. I gotta go back. How many Cousin Vinny jokes have you heard in your life? Jeff, I've- I've heard... a lot. That movie was big when I was in school. 
So everyone had a Cousin Vinny joke. Teachers, you name it. My cousins. Specifically my cousins. But it is a really common name. I mean, I know a lot of people here maybe aren't from New York. Well, they definitely, most people here aren't from New York, but in other parts of the world, Vinny is not a very common name. A little bit here and there, but in New York, especially like New York City, fucking... I am one of millions of Boppity Vinnies. There's even Irish Vinnies. Because why not? Yeah, bomb! <laughs> that plan did not work out so well. We, I'll tell you what, though, I, as much as I'm, like, kind of a little over the Italian food stuff, because I've just been around it my whole life, there is good food. Italians do make good food. But, I mean, did you really need me to tell you that? I, I still don't know if... I haven't been to France. I haven't had very much French food, but I've heard some French folks are real good at food. So I'd like to see what's up with that. And we're back down here now. Great. Oh wait, no, no this is new. The compass! Wow. This far through. Cannolis? Cannolis are really surprisingly good. I don't know how to explain it. It's, it's got like a weird cream in it that is almost ice cream-ish in nature. And it's, it's really sweet in, a, in the right way, vanilla-y. And the crust of the cannoli is like moon rocks. Just this, this flaky delicacy of, of butter and assholes. I mean, and, uh, and good ingredients. Usually we don't talk about food chat because we get people hungry and then people get upset, myself included. And I stream so late that it's not always viable for everyone to go grab a fucking cannoli at 1.30 a.m., myself included. But man, I would love a cannoli right now. Can someone go get me a cannoli? That would be great. They, they're they funny. They have a funny name, but they are pretty badass. theory that no where is it it's over here I don't I don't even want that it could be that could probably be a kinstone piece maybe no Pokemon tonight um, I'm really really tired so Minish Cap will be the last game of the night and also uh, Pokemon will maybe be tomorrow I probably do like a Pokemon stream tomorrow and then do Planet Coaster after that oh here it is Visual clue. I'm enjoying I'm enjoying the shit out of that game. I caught the mushroom Pokemon. Like I'm trying not to play on my own because I don't want to over level and I don't want to like do stuff off stream. But I did manage to catch the mushroom Pokemon and a friend of mine gave me one Pokemon. I haven't been doing, like, trades because it, it everyone wants to trade me everything. 
which is very generous and nice of you guys. But then I wouldn't be able to catch any on my own. But I got a sun exclusive one. Oh, uh, yeah! Right, same spot! I got a sun exclusive one. And it's very cool. Vinny, do you ever feel like you're talking to no nobody while streaming? Um, maybe in the early days. Now? No, I look in chat, people are responding to the things I say, and... Um, I know that even if there is no specific response, that a couple thousand people just heard what I had to say, so I feel very fulfilled. There is no laugh track or dead silence when I tell a bad joke, so I just have to know when I tell a bad joke. Uh, unfortunately, I don't, so I just keep telling bad jokes. If I had the feedback of actual laughter, that might help. It's a stand-up comedy gig. Where I'm bad at stand-up comedy, 24-7. It's a dream job. I think what we need- okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna give you guys a button. Fine sauce button. Like the Amazon button that you can order, like, detergent. Oh god. And if you find a joke funny, you press a button. Now, that button will be hooked up to a speaker that I'll have in my room. And each time you press it, it'll generate a canned laugh. And if enough people press the button, it'll sound like a fucking, like, ferocious applause. And if no one presses it, then it'll just, you know, crickets. Won't be abused at all. No, it wouldn't be. It wouldn't be abused. Everyone would use- would issue restraint. And it would be perfect in every Twitch stream. Hey! I know- is there- Squishy, you still here? You gotta tell this to the big boys up at Twitch. I'm telling you. The Twitch button. And then you can implement another button that gives you an electrical shock when you say something offensive or really stupid. Or maybe both. kill someone. I don't think people get killed. A lot. Because, I mean, the smaller streams... Well, how much electricity are we talking? Wait a minute, now I need to modify this, because... Like, I don't want people to die... too, too much. Like, just a little bit. Just gonna get a little bit of deaths down. This is the future of reality. Of, like, um... Community engagement. You know how that's like a controversy now, where YouTube... Certain channels... That don't upload a lot... Are getting unsubbed from, automatically, and not getting stuff in the channel feed. I think Ethan was talking about it recently. Well... You know... Channels that like, that tell them to like and subscribe and engage... That's where the real... You know, money is on YouTube. So what we have to do... What has to be done course, is to implement this stuff. That way, community interaction will be at an all-time high. Where you get shocked, you get pregnant. Oh, well, yeah, pregnant. And, um, you can get laughter. Oh, look, there it is. You can, um, get pizza. People can order you pizza for your job well done. That wouldn't be abused. Like, comment, and su subscribe, and pizza, and pregnancy. Do I feel chat is integral or essential to the stream? Um... I, I need to look up the exact definition of integral. And I should know this, but... Necessary to make a whole complete essential. I think you just use the same twerd- uh, twerd. Wow. <laughs> you just use the same word twice. 
Just about. And if that wasn't intentional, then, uh... I think the chat is very essential to the streaming experience, and, um, I, I get lots of good Pokémon help. And despite me getting called a fuckface because of my bad microphone jokes, I still genuinely enjoy having the chat, being able to interact with you guys during, like, Darkest Dungeon, or Pokémon, or even tonight when we're just bullshitting. It's fun. It really is. And I think it, it, it's a great part of streaming. On Sundays, it's almost not worth it because there's just too many people and everyone's either japing or memeing or it's just craziness. And that's just Twitch in general. That's just, in my opinion, that's just Twitch culture is is less about, you know, when, when it's a mob mentality, it's less about having a lot of good stuff to say in quality, but, or, or rather less quality good stuff and it's more about a lot of little kind of like memes or or reactions or or you know what i mean it's late i'm my brain isn't functioning right now properly so i'm, I'm doing my best but that's bigger streams smaller streams it's different Less quality, good stuff. Yes, Mono. <laughs> yes. My brain hurt like a warehouse. It had no room to spare. That's how I feel right now. But, yeah, there, there have been, um, chat members that have legitimately made me laugh. There have been chat members that have done extremely nice and generous things for me. And, um, I, I definitely have been helped in, and pointed in the right direction in games. Um, and, you know, we have our little, like, kind of culture. And it's, it's nice. Keyword cult in culture. Which is obviously <laughs> not planned. It's a non-deadly cult, at the very least. I th I'd like to think it's... It's a cult of peace and love! Hopefully. We do have a Discord. There's a Vine Sauce Discord. But I wouldn't be there. I wouldn't... If you guys wanted, like, a sub-Discord or, like, a, a, a thing, I just... I don't- I don't think that's me anymore. When I'm not streaming, I'm off the fucking grid. Oh, check it out! This guy took Roy off the grid! That's me. I like to do that. Because what I do here is- is a lot. And, uh... You know, I like to be- I like to be quiet. I'm- I'm, at the end of the day, someone who enjoys time alone and being an introvert. Not all the time. You know, I like a nice balance between uh, all this nut craziness and conventions and then chill alone time. So yeah, I don't really do the discords, I don't do the chat rooms, I don't do any of that stuff. Social media, a bare minimum. I mean, if you- uh, for you guys, I say sure, but then again, you may as well just do the Vine Sauce Discord, if that's the case. I like the music in this dungeon. I switched the 3DS uh, or the Game Boy Advance sound chip. It wasn't so compressed and 
and and hard to hit, to listen to. <laughs> Social media is what you use for Verizon support. That's ex absolutely true. That is so very true. <laughs> I missed the treasure chest over there. Oh. 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 Um, sub badge sample, any specific subject I should use? Um, sub badge is, is the, the sample, or uh, is the title you could use for the email. Oh, I'm gonna drop in from the top. Zelda and the multi tier dungeons. This game definitely has some good dungeons, good puzzles. Still not as good as Link to the Past in my humble opinion. Uh, like maybe I just have a lot of nostalgia. But when I think of Link to the Past, I think of really fucking good dungeons. Stumped me quite heavily when I was a child. One of my favorite dungeons in Link to the Past, if not my favorite, is Blind's hideout. Where you have to, um... bomb the thing up top. You have to find the right spot to bomb. And there's a bunch of Jape bomb spots so that you get the light down to turn Blind into the, the, you know, the Satan. I think another thing I liked about Link to the Past that not very many Zelda games have given me the feeling of, and again, it could just be a result of me having been the perfect age for that game. I was six when it came out. I played it when I was um, six into like, you know, seven and eight. And the Dark World, getting to the Dark World for the first time was just fucking crazy and there's that like mood and and like the feel of the dark world was was just perfect and creepy and weird and and the dungeons in the dark world had the ominous music and and their their theme you know of, of just things being slightly tw twisted and warped and even though dark world has been done a few times in Zelda I don't think they ever really got it as good as Link to the Past. And again, you may disagree. That's just my thoughts on it. On the, the, uh, the Dark World situation. Majora, yeah, I mean, well, that's a different thing. You know, Majora for me was... It was like dark and twisted and weird and, and it was like a twisted version of Ocarina. But it had its own kind of unique flavor to it. I mean, that is a good argument. But you are talking about one game. Well. That's a, yeah, that's good. That's, I, I didn't even fucking consider that. I guess Majora is like a twisted, darker version of OOT. Down to the, the characters and like their motivations and stuff. I love this guy in chat who just wrote, Dr. Faxu just wrote, Hey Vinny, I'm from Argentina. I do not understand much of what you say, but I am having fun anyway. And then he put a Bob Ross emote. You just made my night. I'm not even kidding, you just made my entire night.
Um, yeah, I guess it's not that I didn't necessarily consider the, the Majora's Mask thing. It's, it's more... I never really considered it a dark world, I just considered it its own world, its own game. But, when you, when you really think about it, it is just... Hyrule flipped upside down. It is, it is the dark world of From a Link to the Past of Ocarina's Hyrule, in a way. Huh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I, I've nailed it. I don't remember this boss at all. Holy shit. It's an assault creature. What now? I don't even know. Oh god, I don't know what to do. Mode 7. Oh, I saw the eye. Okay. And then it explodes. Wow, this is... This is pretty badass. Fucking put a arrow through this thing's skull, because that would be great. No, damn. And size of these things are consistent with rupees. Small being green and the smallest denomination of rupee. Blue being medium, five, five rupee, middle, middle denomination. Red being 20, just in case you needed me to spell it out. Maybe for that dude in Argentina. I can be a little confusing at times. I could cheese it, can't cheese. Concentration. We're in concentration mode right now. Whew. Oh shit. Still a zero death run. Maybe I can go into the Guinness Book of Fucking Idiots.
The wind carries the seeds of flowers, scattering life across the land. The wind element is the embodiment of that power. Cool. Well, that worked out. At last, we got all four elements. Let's go revive the sacred blade. Burb Sanctuary. Oh, I have it this time. Perfect. Oh man, I have so many kinstone things that I still haven't collected. Yo, night Joel. Have a good one, dude. There's a lot of bird things in this game. Birds with bird things on them. Like seahorses. You can fuse with the Elder again. Which one's the Elder? Is it the one who looks like Jesus? No. You can't do a few side quests. Make 100% sure you've done as much as you can do before you go into the sanctuary. Okay. The Elder is on the top floor. Oh, great. Thanks, Elder. Elder had to be... all the way up here. As far away from me as possible. Do I plan on getting another dog? No, I don't. Not anytime soon. Or maybe never have the right piece. I'm, uh, I'm kind of not home a lot. And I can barely, like, take the time for friends or, like, family, you know, or myself. It's, it's hard. Because I do, is you know, I like to devote a lot of time to the stream. I like to devote a lot of my time to music. And then there's just time you have to spend just doing stuff. Dogs are a lot of work, and they require a lot of love and attention. And I like dogs, but I just, uh, I don't, I don't think it would happen. I don't, I don't think, I don't think a dog is in the cards for me. What about a dog-shaped cat? I'll tell you what we'll do, mate. We'll take the dog. We'll lop the hind legs off. Put a beak on him. Give him a couple feathers. And he's a bird. Tell you what we'll do, squire. different kind of pet. Eh, I'm not really feeling pets right now. I don't know. I had a bird. I had a cockatiel when I was a young, young child. And, um, it was loud, and it would lay eggs and then bite everyone. So yeah, that was a good time. Uh, yeah, the way I see it, I don't think at this point in my life I'm ready to have dominion other another over another life form. That just <laughs> like I'd rather do that in Animal Crossing. You know, I'm I'm good on on real pets. It's like I gotta go feed them and buy food for them and then you know make sure I remember to feed them and not have them die. It's you know it's a lot of responsibility to make sure a thing doesn't die. I don't know if I'm ready for that kind of responsibility. What did you do with the eggs? I, um... I, I, you want me to say scrambled eggs, right? But instead, I'm going to say... You had to d get rid of them, because they, they weren't actually fertilized eggs. 
So. A pet mushroom sounds nice, or a pet rock. These are good options. I like these options. So what things can't I do if I uh, fuse or if I if I get the the thing the upgrade? I didn't do a kinstone fusion with Zelda. Oh yeah, the Goron Cave. There's that. Yeah. May as well fucking spend some of my rupees. new skill. I'm ready to train you again. I once had a chicken nugget as a pet. That was an easy pet to take care of until it started rotting. It took about four years for that to happen, though, because McDonald's, they do a good job of making sure that their uh, food can last four years out in the hot sun, you know, and not rot. It's cool. Down thrust. First, equip the rock's cape. Second, equip the sword. Jump, and then the press the thing. I understand. Do you have to take control of my body first? Fuck. Here we go again. to make. I actually don't know how to do it. Just the jump. It's the jump and not the glide. You gotta tap the button. And even then, you have to tap it just right. Because, like... Yeah, you, it's a very, very specifically timed move. Let's see. Uh, there's the bell heart piece. Uh, there's also fusing with with the goddesses. There's one. Now, I know what fusing with the goddesses sounds like. And I think you people are filthy. Hey, did you know that Magmar has six tits on its head? I did every Chicken Catch minigame. I did all. All parts of Chicken Catch. And no, I did not have a good time.
Later, Spoopy. Okay, so there's one in the swamp, one in the in the uh, Spoopy, and then one. Let's find out. I actually don't know where this goddess is. Kind of forgot where the house was built. Kinstone with Zelda. I'm gonna do that. I will. I think this is the one. Yeah, this is it. Vinny, would you rather eat a whole ass or an asshole? Is that original, Link? X321, is that an original joke? Is that OC? Because if so, that's pretty good. Actually, I enjoyed that. Oh, sorry, chicken. Okay, so, how, where's Zelda? How to, how to Kinstone? Kinstone. It's not, yeah, some people are saying that's bullshit. You can't Kinstone Zelda. So that people, what were people talking about? Like a missable kinstone fusion then? Zelda is a stone. So it's okay. So then, what's the missable? What's the missable one? Going from the other side, bin. From the top. Of it. Oh. Oh boy, hundred rupees. The light arrows one. I, I did that one. Fuse with all the Blade Masters in Hyrule. Can you fuse with them? Oh, it's this thing again. This area. So now I have to go in through there, wherever that is. And I can get that treasure chest, which will have a whopping 700 rupees in it. Just check in now for the stuff, the walls that you can fuse with. The glory holes. Okay. Doesn't look like there's one here. I'm sure I got whatever this is already. Yep, got that. I know there's a sword master on Na Mount Crenando. Oh, 
Okay, I can't fuse with this one. Zelda as a statue is missable. You can only do it before the castle gets fucked by Vadi. I'm not japing. This is the kinstone many people miss the first time they play their game. The game. Last entrance is in the mayor's yard. Well, he's not my mayor. It's just some guy. I didn't vote for him. My mayor is the guy who works hard in fixing this town. Cannot fuse with Zelda, ignore them. I think they would know, they're called Angelic Zelda. That's the chat name. So I'm gonna take their word for it. how red his face is. Here we go. Rupees. Wow. Fused with Otacon of the piss stain in the locker under the crib. Some of the best japes of 2016. Actually, the crib- crib jape was 2015. Even though it was there, so it's not really a jape, it's- it was just hard to find. What book? I don't know, um, someone asked recently where was the first time I said the word jape? I don't know. I really don't. I mean, it is, it's a word I've heard a bunch from, like, reading stuff. Like, probably Lord of the Rings has the word jape in it. Game of Thrones, I, I read all the Ice and Fire books. So, I mean... Yeah, I've, I've heard the word. It's a real word. It, it's just, uh, you know, it means... Well, it means... A, a ruse. So, someone probably rused me. They took me on a ruse cruise. And I decided to... I said the word Jape for some unknown reason. I'd be curious to see what the first stream I actually said that on was. The last wall fusion is a lake, Mount Crenando, next to Hermit. Okay. Your face is beaming. More money you can't hold. Ah! Salad Dongs in chat just said, Did you know that Jape isn't in the dictionary? Do you know what that is? That is the definition in the dictionary. If you go into the dictionary, you see Salad Dongs telling me that, Did you know the word Jape isn't in the dictionary? Very good. Very good. You've mastered it. Ah! Leave not with other what others tell you, I am the true master swordsman of Hyrule. My name is Greyblade, and if you train with me, you'll learn much. I will train here. Roll attack. Scream haya and swing your sword. Oh, I have to scream haya.
I am become Jape Destroyer of, of, uh, something. I'm sure there's some good way to say that. My, my, my brain doesn't come to All these creeps throughout Hyrule. Each one of them posing as swordsmiths and, and fucking master, wise masters. So there's only one tiger scroll left. Remote bombs. Uh, I, I can... I don't know. I really don't care too much about remote bombs. I'll get them anyway. The ghost in the swamp, right? Thank you. But we need to get um, the go ball. Go ball! Gold bond. Sorry, gold bond. There's a, a stone here somewhere that's gonna get me to another gold bond. So it's not up this way. Uh, you need all the scrolls to get that one. Well, I have all but one. Does that count? I thought maybe the last scroll was the last one on that list, or maybe there's another one. I don't, I don't know. Find this gold bond. The glory hole. It's somewhere. It's it's where is it? My no death run almost ended just there. North left. Hey Desert, can you start banning people for saying north left? Cuz that would be great. Don't actually do that. Northeast. You climb too slow. I think this is it. I don't recall having dug through there. Hello. Oh, yeah, here's the hermit. It's left of the hermit. Someone in chat said left of Kermit earlier, and I was like, what the fuck do you mean? And now I get it. I might stream, yeah, the city skyline natural disaster. Someone asked if I'm gonna stream it when it comes out. Yeah, 
I got a little bored of City Skyline. I don't think I'm much of a extended SimCity kind of guy. I never was, actually. I, like, I would play the SimCity games, enjoy them, and then give up after some time. Um, I wouldn't mind returning to my city when the disaster thing comes out and then destroying it in, in interesting and creative ways. It is out. Well, shit. Well, shiver me timbers. I'll certainly consider it for, uh, soon. How's that? How's that for a fucking vague answer? I'll certainly consider it for soon. I should be a politician. An army of gold, gold bonds. Only one more left. So where that shit at? The last wall fusion is the northmost point at Lake Hylia by using Rock's Cape. Good intel. So this is how you get this heart piece. It's Rock's Cape. Ah. Yeah, no. It's a little, little hard to fucking control. Minus one whole point from this game's score. Because of Rock's Cape. Ugh. 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 Okay. I remember, like, um, there was, uh, I think I made a video of this, but there was, like, a, I think it was Giant Bomb. They were taking a look at Game & Wario art, which is something I've done a bunch, if, if you've seen my streams in the past. I, I used to draw the one-minute things. That's where Speed Luigi was devised. And, uh... Yeah, they were going through, and they saw one of my horrendous pieces of art that wasn't even funny. It was just stupid. And, uh, the, they were going through, I forget which one of them, I don't know their names, but one of them, like, he went like this. He saw that it said Vine Sauce, and he, he went like this. Vine Sauce? Ugh. <laughs> it's like, so, I like that so much that I made a video out of it to promote Vine Sauce. I thought that was swell. You need a link. Uh, I'm not going through my videos now to try to find it, but it's it's there. It's just somewhere. I had a feeling there was some gold bonds in need of a little extra tussle. Welp, I'm here to help. Hey, a derpy timing, everybody. 
Everybody okay now? Together now, Goro! Oh, they did it. Oh, that's not the one. That's the Flinket promo. It's somewhere on this great big old internet. I'll squeeze gets. That lined up perfectly. <laughs> did it? Did you like that? I gotta, I gotta watch that and see how well it lined up if it did. It takes exactly six gold bonds to break through there. Exactly six. No less. No more. No, no fewer. Very, very girthy, very substantial. Oh, I can't wait for the rupees. So many rupees. Oh, it's a heart piece this time. And 200 rupees. And 200 mysterious shells. <laughs> oh. the shells do? Well, what they do is shells will tell you to buy things and they'll say something's real great and they might do it in an offhanded way so that you don't necessarily immediately know that they're trying to sell you something. But they are. But it do. But it do. Shameless promotion. It's like when I talk about how much I like Westworld. Turns out I'm just, you know, chilling for HBO. Like they need me to tell people to watch their show, that's incredible. Oh, my body may perish, I'm still the true Swordsmaster. Swiftblade the first, Spirit of the Swordsman. If you train with me, I will teach you skills that are out of this world. Yes. This is a technique that only I have mastered. Only one who holds the sacred blade can perform the great spin attack. First, do a spin dash. Attack, rather. Then press the button repeatedly. Repeatedly. Do you hear me? That is all, young swordsman. But it's not so easy. One must feel the technique. Oh, now let me get inside your body. Ooh. Learn! Only I have learned the art of pressing buttons rapidly! Oh, 
Uh, I, look, there's a gold snake there. I don't even care. That gold snake is not doing anything for me. to an entire heart container. Okay, I had to read. Someone put something about, um, I get... The library gets cut off when I do the, the next sword. But I also gain, um... Access to a thing that can get me a full heart. So that's pretty... Pretty cool. Fifty mysterious shells. For real, though, what do shells do? You can buy figurines with them. Just these little collectibles that there are many of. And you collect them, and then eventually you get a heart piece. But you need to do the, the, the machine like 130 times to get the heart piece. It's not really worth it, in my, in my opinion. It's kind of lame. This puzzle is hard. This game is too hard. Please... Do not make me do this. Swordsman, who are you? Swordsmanship is spirit. I am the finest, or maybe second finest, swordsman in all of Hy Hyrule. Scarblade. Training with me will forever transform your swordsmanship. So, would you like to train here? Is this a Jape Swordsman? I'll teach you how to quickly unleash your uh, spin attack. Okay. Close your eyes and visualize your sword moving at an unthinkable speed. Now, you may feel... Something that feels like fingers on your rippling thighs. But that's just the technique. Keep your eyes closed. Commit yourself to the blade. I have to Kermit myself to the blade. See, this one didn't possess me. Sweaty swordsmith lying at an incredibly high speed. Gappy says, it sure is fun to capitalize each initial letter for each separate word. Bro, have you never put claps between each word? That is the true good shit. How about capitalizing and claps? And then capitalizing entire words and leaving certain random spaces in between the letters for emphasis. Mmm! Magnifico! Got that already. the butterfly things. Forgot about that. It's a lot. 
A lot of side quests in this game. African tuna man, I don't know why, but you just made me laugh really hard. Fuck you. Butterfly. This butterfly. Where where is this thing? In the old ruins. What do you guys think the internet will be like in 2031? That's it, just... You just get the butterfly and you just can shoot arrows faster? That's cool as fuck, I didn't- I just- that's unexpected, I didn't think that would happen. This same garbage memes censored more memes, Kanye West clap. I don't think that, I think that was just an old sentence. Uh, hey, listen. Well, I just did a Navi thing by accident. Hey, listen, uh, where the fuck is the other butterflies? Because I, I forgot. I was not, I guess I wasn't paying attention. Small snippet, snippets, no substance. Oh man, have I got a song for you. There's still one in Caster Wilds. Yes, where is the other butterflies? All right, graveyard. That's right. Well, weren't vines pretty much just small snippets of, like, ADD juice? No offense to anyone with ADD, I, I get it. it, sucks, you know, but... It's like, um... You go on Facebook, or, or like, a lot of social media, and it's just like... Here's a small snippet of a thing... For your entertainment. And then you go to click on it so you can see the whole thing, but it's- it only ever was six seconds. Only ever. Only ever was it six seconds. Ah, some of them are pretty well done. It's not just about vines, you know, it's just the whole... The whole thing of like the short snippets of things of like rapid fire mass consumption. I'm guilty. I am guilty. I click on those things. I like short little gifts that give me like a little nug of, of happiness. Just a tiny little nug. Again, like like they said, no substance. Just a nug. And uh, you know, and then you're done. I'm beginning to think there isn't another butterfly here in the Caster Wilds. Swamp. 
elevated grounds. All right, well, let's go kill this thing. Oh, there's substance. I'll tell you what. I found TV to have a lot of substance. Like a lot of TV shows, like, have have given me that the more than just a nug. They've given me like a quarter pounder with cheese. Bad analogy. They've given me a nice steak dinner with with nice fresh green vegetables on the side. I think that's better. <laughs> better of an analogy. Um. There are still some good movies. There's good movies. I mean, it's- it's- it's out there. You just gotta sift. You gotta sift and find the stuff that has more than just Nug. And then if, you know, if- if you want that. Some people don't want that. It's funny because, uh, man, I don't want to give anything away. I really don't, but... This is just a fun- funny topic to be talking about right now, because this is how I spent my my night last night. Like, for three hours. Just thinking about all this and absorbing it and trying to translate it. Not into another language, but... Yeah, I'm, I'm being vague on purpose. But yeah, it's, uh... Nug life, you know? That's, that's society. You like the blur? There it is. What can I do faster than before? I did not read that, because I was thinking about how clever I was. Because Blur has an album called Park Life, I'm gonna make one called Nug Life, and it's gonna be about just nuggets of small information with no real nutritional value. I can, uh, dig faster. Thank you. Oh, the people! So many people! No sh- no shit! Just randomly three red kinstone pieces. Um, I see a little entryway into something over there and I'm very curious about that. Speaking of pee pool, do you guys know the pee pool story? Just to take this into a, a, a silly direction. Some of you do. This was, I, I told this story during, during a, a stream a long time ago. It was a stream of how one of my cousins came over and went swimming in my pool. And, um, he, he kind of like, just w like waddled. It, imagine waddling in water. Kind of just waddled over to me while I was uh, hovering around there, and he and he kind of like he like he swam over to me. It's swimmies on, you know, big thick Harry Potter like glasses. And I'm like, what's going on? You know, what's up? And he he looks at me and he just says, pee pool. I say what? Pee pool. What do you, what do you mean pee pool? He goes like pee pool. He said it like that. Pee pool. I was like, no! No, you swim away from me! You swim away from me! And thus I felt a slight degree of warmness. And it turned out he had- he had done as he said he would do. And I have never regarded that child as a liar. Ever since. Pee pool. That's the- that's the whole story. Fascinating, right? I should, like, spice it up. You know, I should start, like, finding ways to spice up my boring stories and add, like, twists. Spiciness. Just, like, fake them right up. Uh, I can't find that thing I was looking for, so I, I give up. I was looking to get small so I can go swim into that little cave. I'll try one more time.
He didn't shit in the pool. He just peed in the pool. I thought that was made implicitly clear. Like, why- Why are you expecting so much more? He just said pee pool. And then he did what he said he would do, and then- And then I got out of the pool. And then life went on as normal. So yeah, you have to really travel really far to get from... Uh, let's let's try this. I want to try this because this this small is on the entire opposite side of the fucking map. How would I even go about getting to where I have to go to? You just instantly drown. Yeah, John Stamos doesn't need to be in this- in this totally true story. John St John Stamos was not there to film him, shame him, or masturbate, so that was... You need to fuse to get a lily pad to appear. Oh, okay. So, you know what? Fuck it. I- I gotta be honest, I don't think I'm gonna end up getting all the heart pieces in this game. And I like getting all the heart p pieces in my Zelda streams. This game, there's just too many. Too many little things, little fusions, there's- I have to get 130 fucking figurines to get the last heart piece. I'm probably just gonna pass. Wood. That's a good Alice in Chains song, Wood. Go to the library. I, I gotta get to the graveyard. Could you believe I keep fucking forgetting how to get into the goddamn graveyard? Every... time. Every time. through here. I remember now. I'm surprised they don't make it a little easier for, for you to get there. Like, it's not entirely obvious. And you have to, uh... Yeah, there's no shortcut. Well, it's not too bad to get to, but it's just a little... It's a little more deceptively far away than you might think in, at first glance. I bet that dude does, really doesn't know what the fuck I'm talking about now. Left, left, up. Stop. Do not lick. Right. Stop. Alright. Okay. Right. Swim faster than before. It's 
Yeah, I have this on my 3DS too. I had the ambassador thing. Oh, you found the giant bomb reaction. Poignant, I suppose. Ugh. Yeah. Fine sauce. Well, I think that's gonna do it for Game and Wario. I was the last one they saw. Ugh. That wasn't my promo. That was the actual video. My promo was good because I used it to promote the stream and and uh, and to make it like, hey, check out this stream. You'll love it. Ugh. There's nothing to see. There's nothing to see. It's just you just look at it and it's just a shitty drawing of an Xbox One that I had to do in 60 seconds. Um, my eyes are getting very, very heavy, but I do want to do a little bit more in this game, which is to say... Library. And then I want to go see the Gobons. What's there to do in the library? Read books. Go small. Go small and go into the cave next to the library. What do you mean, this one? Didn't I do this one? I did do this one. Oh, the bookshelf. The guy who did Ugh was Ryan, and he died just after that video was made. What? Like that was his- someone in chat said that was his last video. What the hell? Are you serious? Well that sours the fucking stream. I think I heard something like that though, that sounds um... That doesn't sound entirely inaccurate. It was his last video. Ryan Davis passed away after that last video. What the fuck? I don't think there's anything to do here. I got all this stuff. Oh shit. Heart attack on his honeymoon. What a fucking... Garbage. Wow, that, that sucks. That poor guy. Appreciate every moment when you got it. Every fucking moment. Just enjoy, enjoy, and, and help others enjoy. Can that dude from Argentina come back? I need like a little pick-me-up. No, that's okay. I mean, it's it, it happened. You're saying it sours the stream, but it happened. It's like, it's fine. It's better to know these things, I guess. It's in the cave with the cats guarding it. I, I kind of already did that though, no?
I really don't know what you guys are asking me to go to. Uh, I've also been told to go to the post office. There's a book in there. Okay, yeah, let's let's see if I can find the post office. And then I want to do the Gobon thing, and then we'll do a little bit more side quests next time, and then finish the game. I just need to find the fucking post office. Okay, here it is. This is the Swordsman newsletter number one. Some walls go boom. May look like a regular wall, but maybe something can blow it up. Power in your sword and start stabbing the wall. Cool. I, I have all this. You can explode things with bombs. Explode. I like the word explode. Because it sounds, again, it sounds filthy. But it's not. It's just a short way of saying explode. But, like, I'm thinking we could turn it into something even greater, like an explosive load. Ex explode. Like, oh man, that was a fucking, that was a splode and a half. Good quality commentary by Vine Sauce at 3 in the morning. Quality qu commentary. <laughs> okay, if you say words, can't pronounce, too tired to speak. Oh, really? I can't get down there. Probably need a kinstone fusion. Where are you even going? I don't know, I was trying to get that heart piece. Through the cave in Lake Hylia. Well, there is a cave there. That is accurate. Break some signs. Uh, I'm gonna go see the Gorons. I've, I've, I've had enough of this shit. This, this shit, this video game shit. I fed up with these video game world. Oh man, 200 rupees, yeah! These bars are the bees. Wait, what? I said. Is it? Well, at least it's something a little different. It's not rupees. Fused with the Goron on the far right. I don't think the, uh, they're, they're fusible. I know, I know you fuse with one, then you can get the mirror shield after you complete the game. Seriously, though, could you imagine it was just 200 seashells? Oh, man. Oh, I would have hated that. get all six of them to explode their Lon Lon milk into of uh, the bottle. This is my fault. This is my fault. I've, I've created this tone so that people say things like that and it's totally acceptable. And you know what? I encourage it. Good job. Yeah. 
in their language, they would call it a gadompa dump. Can't wait to get those seashells. I've been here already. Whoa, super fast. Well, this is an upgrade that would have come in handy a while back. Yeah, I did all this. Hmm. There's a few things over here. Potion. Potions are available. unlocked as an upgrade. Oh, okay. I'm gonna want that. I'll do that now. Isn't this where I get remote bombs? How did I do that just now? I was able to do a, a very fast spin. Fuse with the Elder in the hoods. Hoods. Okay. I'll fuse with the Hoods Elder. These like likes don't steal your shield. <laughs> yeah, they don't steal your shield in this game, so they're not so bad. I used to be very afraid of like likes. steal your shield. Oh, but I guess you have to have the shield up. What are they called? Kerberators? Are, that's called a like-like, is it not? Or is that something different? Remember, you can fuse with the Minish village in the... Finish the military village swimming to him. He's fusing a few times. Went back to the area. Jeez. Yeah, that'll be next time. That's a lot. I'd live in a mushroom. If I had, a ch you know, if I had the chance. Press your sword just a second later. Need to do it after the roll to do the spin. Cool. The remote bobs are complete! You ever need normal bombs again? Just trade me back for them. So you want remote bombs? 
Thanks, dude. There's a really weird timing to get the uh, spin thing right after the, the, the dash. Okay, so you can't set multiple bombs, but they I can see that being very useful for um, bosses. Alright, now let's go get that upgrade. Last task of the night. And then I can sigh eternally. Oh. I did it again accidentally that time. Hit an enemy with the roll dash stab, not from perfect timing. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was wondering because I, I was doing it ex like in a thousand different ways, but it's fine. So that upgrade I just got, where where was that exactly? That was Eastern Hyrule Field, was it? Uh, was it Eastern Hills? No, it wasn't Eastern Hills. It was. Falls North, maybe it was North Hyrule Field. Yeah, it was North Hyrule Field. Bad memory, bad attention span. I told you, I, I'm into, I, you know, nugget culture is sadly something I'm, I'm very guilty of being a part of. I like those quick juicy shack meat. Ah, another one. Great blade this time. He's kind of almost the best, he said. Alright. Prolong the duration of the great spin attack. Visualize training very seriously. Sort continuing to move longer than ever possible. Spinning, 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 spinning! No. That's cool. Commit yourself to the blade and stuff, he said. Th I don't think this guy knows what the fuck he's talking about. Basically, his upgrade was telling me that I should spin longer, and Link was like, okay, and that was it. use Cyclone. Sometimes all you do need is some direction, you're right, like if someone tells you that if you edge yourself just before the moment of completing the sword spin, and you just hold off a little bit, and then you, then you, you know, then you do it again, then you, then you hold off a little bit, then you do it again, then you hold off a little bit. That's, um, that's the direction that Link needs to get an even more powerful sword slash that busts at maximum capacity. <laughs> B 
busts enemies in two. It's another upgrade over there. It's time for the stream to end now. Okay. Sound like Dennis from Always Sunny? Well, that's the implication. I don't know, dude! I'm, I'm kind of more into milk steak, dude, lately! And, like, ghouls! I don't know why my Charlie Kelly is, is like, just manic craziness like that. <laughs> it's such a bad impression. <laughs> But I don't care. <laughs>